Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, whatever you're watching, folks. This is ZU Dracul, and welcome back to Life is Strange. Today, we're picking up right where we left off, starting chapter four. And I'm really excited to see what happens in this chapter. I mean, it's been the ending of the last chapter blew my mind when we broke the universe. So I have no idea how this this chapter is going to play out. This is amazing. The game has gotten really intense. Although I do feel so far that the choices I've made really haven't made a difference. That the ending of each chapter was going to be the ending. The only big change that I, that I did was when I went back and saved um, Max's friend. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. Like you said, it's time Which, that doesn't really seem that important either, because she hasn't been in the story since well, then. She's been in the hospital, and no one can visit her, which I found really weird. For someone with depression, you might want people to go see her and cheer her up and make her feel better. Go see her friends, you know? I always found- I found- I find that odd. Being someone who suffers from chronic depression myself, I love being around people. I love being around my friends and stuff. I don't understand why you would want to lock away someone who tried to kill themselves because they were chronically depressed. My fucking dad, of course. Hello. I mean, that, that, I don't know. That just didn't make any sense to me. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. And that's where we broke the universe. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. There we go. What else have I changed? It was cutting off top of my head. Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe, you have the a visitor. The most crazy reveal ever happened right there. That was some mind-blowing stuff. Having her wheel up in a wheelchair like that. I don't even know. That was, that was just, it was just crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ow. Hi, microphone. I need to get a, like, a mount for this. I really do. Which I'll probably get next month. So are we on the beach with the dead whales? Square Enix. <laughs> and then this. This is really an awkward scene. Well, don't nod. Oops, sorry. It's actually don't don't because it's forwards and backwards. I don't know. I, I, I didn't notice that until, like, the... Where's my flash drive? Never mind. It's right here. <laughs> it was, like, back this way, and I didn't know it was on my necklace still. Um, I didn't notice that until, like, chapter... Till we started playing through episode three. That I didn't realize that don't... It was don't don't. Like, forward... It was don't forwards and backwards. Which is interesting. Yay! Find it really odd. I don't know where this chapter can even go. Like, the only thing that I can think is maybe going back to the other timeline and you know fixing, making it so her dad dies, and fixing the universe. I mean, that's the only thing I can think of. That's the only thing that I can. It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I would assume so. I'm glad we are though. It was nice even though sent me actual technically. Letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even wrote on that mm. parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. But yeah. I'm writing on it like an English poet. You deserve the Because it's parchment and really old looking. Probably easier to write than to visit me. Oh, come on. Bitchy way. Not totally. But partly. <laughs> to avoid awkward conversations like this. This is a super. Uh, this is super awkward. Pretty, I'm not sure what to say. Yeah. I'm not sure what to say. The worst thing you I don't do know how to say in that situation. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? Okay. 
Yeah. This is seriously the best. You're gonna go look at the whales. Like, what do photographers call that? The golden. The horizon. Head. See. Okay, that works too. Are you here? I have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Yeah, but she doesn't have her camera on her, which I find odd. There's like five of them. Holy it crap! Is. I'm alive here with you. What's up with the whales? You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about Jesus. Are you Let's talk about the exit. Talk about I don't want to blame Willie. Ask about blaming Willem for, William for anything. There's not much to say. Who hit her? Some or how did she get into an accident? Do you remember everything? I saw That's a terrible a question to ask. Time. I felt my back snap. Matrix reference. And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. <laughs> I actually had a had an uncle that was quadriplegic. Couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. I I don't so, know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm like happy I did get to see you again. That would just be terrible. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. I'm going to say that she doesn't know her in this. You, say, Rachel you mean Rachel? When yeah. When was the last time you talked to her? Probably never. In this world, she probably never even went to Blackwell. I didn't even know her name. You did? This yeah. I felt like that was going to be the case. World than when we were kids, isn't it? This is such a different world than it was 10 minutes ago. <laughs> Um, do you, you think? think so? She seems like very scientific y, smart like. The details. I have more time on my hands. Let's find out. Me. Plus, I'm a science nerd. Told you. None of this makes sense. She's completely different. She's a completely different person. She's not even Chloe as anymore. Not dead. really. I don't feel afraid. Hanging out not the same Chloe. I mean, she's still Chloe, but she's bad. not Chloe. You don't even know. Not Listen. The blue, the blue-haired punk I'm rocker sorry, that was such you. an awesome character. I'm not gonna say that she's not an awesome character because I don't know as much about her. But you're my best friend, Max. Thanks for coming out to see me. You're you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my my nose is. I don't either. Maybe we should get back to my place. That wind does it's sound really Hella really Hella. harsh. Hella, I hate that word. No offense. Are you kidding me? None taken. Yeah, she's not Chloe. <laughs> this Chloe isn't isn't the same Chloe. She is two hundred percent different. That is insane. How much different her life and her personality is just from that small change. I mean, to her it was a big change because it was I mean it was one change in history that changed a bunch of things. But the fact that that one small change made Chloe such a completely different person and changed her life in such a crazy way. That's mind-blowing. The fact that the developers even came up with that story arc is crazy. Wow. I don't even... Hmm. This is interesting. You know, I was just thinking about it. Pretty I had that theory in the. Feels like a high tech. Cell. Yeah, it is. But I am a lot of tech around. To take care of me. I had the theory in the last episode that. You are here with them. Right. Yeah. Especially don't you go do something? Even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic. <laughs> That's. Better than the Chloe from the other universe that just You're kind and does whatever. When you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still it's get true. rage on. Especially I'm sure. when the nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still it was, it's just it's a terrible it's life. Since we were it is. Thanks again for coming, Max. I uh <clears throat> Need to get my drink on. Uh, can Thirsty? You, can you bring me some water? Yeah. 
It's probably a couple of water rounds. But no, I had that theory in the last... I have said that like five times, but I kept getting interrupted because I thought they were going to stop talking. But uh, I had that theory in the last episode where I was like, Max would could be like... Or Rachel could be would be Max could be Max from the future because they look alike and all the things that they like people say they look the same and she put on her clothes and all the you know all those different things. But when we went back into the past at the end of that episode and broke the universe, she became herself in the past. Now I don't know if there's like a way around that where you, when you travel back in time that like maybe she'll become powerful enough and like find a way that she can like become like keep her own body and not go into her it's past nice body sent a card at i wouldn't be surprised but it's becoming less likely because of the because of that one specific thing where when she went back in time she became herself she didn't become like a she wouldn't stay oh, you know 18 year old max she no, became no, like 13 year old max or whatever she was I, I, however old she was i wasn't paying attention i don't remember i was paying attention but i don't remember podcast or something I wish I a could podcast punch face right now. A podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Oh, like, come on. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an I'm guessing the try thing is what you're talking about. It seems like we were kids in another life. Yeah. Um to seems me, like yesterday. It seems like yesterday we were little brats here. Watching Power Rangers. Oh, and all the feels. The kitchen. Oh my god. We covered everything in flour. Even my parents. That was so hilarious. That actually sounds fun. <laughs> a long time ago. You're the only person that I grew up with who visits me. As you can see, I can't visited you once. Apparently. Um. Which friends? friends? Did you hang out with the most? Megan Weaver, but you don't know her. She was cool. Isn't that the. But after my accident, she was too cool. Isn't to she the girl that was that we've like saved? No Ma isn't Megan loser. her? But I am. I think that's Megan. Right? How? Dude, you're not Supermax, and I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what okay. my parents are for. <laughs> her parents specifically. <laughs> um. Are, are they okay? okay? I mean. Are they still happy together and everything? So now you're Dr. I would Bill. hope so. I guess they're Bill. Good, considering they have to deal with me. <laughs> they laugh and hold hands. And I hope they still get busy too. I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max. Why would you hope that? The accident has been so hard on them. That's a weird thing. I hope my parents Jets still do that. And the medical bills are fucking insane. What? <sighs> Um, I, I bet they are. Look at all that stuff around her. That isn't that that is crazy. got to be extremely expensive. Yeah, the drugs, what she said. The nurses, the supplies. Mom and Dad always broke, and they get so frustrated. Yeah. Is it worth it? I understand. Chloe. Of course it is. It's Chloe. Uh, <laughs> Even if she's a completely different person in this universe, it's still Chloe, and she's helped us through all this stuff. And they are really good friends. So. Of course, I know a geek when I be one. See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. Oh, hardy, hardy, har. To chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> what do you want to watch? Uh, yeah. I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know, I they have so many actual like references to I know. things that people do. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when we watch movies. I remember Max. Because so they, uh... Asleep. Not when you're here. They have this thing where, like, they have, like, Max, who is, like, trapped in, like, wanting to do things, like, with old-fashioned equipment and old-fashioned cameras and stuff. Yeah, and then, like, so cool that you're here not even having a cell phone. I'm fairly certain she texts with, her, with a tablet, which, I mean, that's pretty new age or whatever. But they have this thing where it's, like, it's, like trying to feel old style and then but also having modern things like when you look at like victoria's stuff like she's getting 3d printers and uh has really fancy equipment and like modern stuff so it's like this split where it's like max is using really old stuff and she can time travel which kind of fits her ability to like traveling back in time she uses old things i don't know i just found that that specific thing really interesting about this 
And this has been like 15 minutes and nothing has happened at all. This is ridiculous. Let's open this drawer. Aha, here's the DVD. That was quick. What's in here? Oh my god. The CDs. I need that mix for her when we were 12. I'm going to say that she probably doesn't have that in the current timeline. Oh yeah, give snow globes to the person that can't shake them. I mean, of course, she, I know that we she likes snow globes because she mentioned it in the normal timeline. But in the normal timeline, she can get up and she can enjoy them. These are halfway across the room from her. Actually, they're all the way across the room from her. Let's put the DVD in. After we watch this DVD, we will go ahead and call this... Or once we... After this scene, we'll probably call it, go ahead and call it quiz. It's going to be like 30 minutes, 30 minutes probably after this whole thing gets finished with. It's like watching drugs with explosions. Holy crap. Like straight up, th there's just like rainbow colors on the screen. <laughs> they are watching physical drugs on TV. And I'm guessing that they both fell asleep on each other. Probably. Yeah, I'm right. Or is Chloe awake? Nope, Chloe's awake. Did she stay awake all night? Yeah. She probably did. She sounds like did. I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. How dare you. I know you were beat down after the day with me. And Blade Runner... How? We didn't do anything. Uh, do you, do so you Chloe did fall asleep, but she woke up first. Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No. Yeah, she's probably been awake for a while. I crashed so hard. Were you okay? Well, I hope. I have a mother and father when you're not falling asleep on me. You are Only baby. when she's That's not asleep? <laughs> <laughs> Yesterday was such a blast. It they, was great. I mean, I guess they watched a movie together, but they really did I do much. Were different. We were just three well, I mean, I can't. They, they can't really, but I mean, they could have gone out and done other things, like jumping and I don't know, running through the forest. Not just walk to the beach. There's plenty of places to walk to. to me just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. <sighs> Fuck. Um. I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you pretty please go upstairs and get my, my morphine? In the bathroom? Holy morphine. mother of God! It's, it's total Star Trek shit. I take that can back. I the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep the swag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a I'm gonna say I'm gonna take back what I said and oh, say God. that. Uh, Maybe they couldn't do more, because if she has that much pain, that is ungodly. Morphine is crazy. Okay. Wow. But I think I'm going to call this episode finished. We really didn't do anything, but we did... Stop hitting the mic with your hand! Ha! <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> um... We really didn't do anything, but we did find out some backstory on what's going on with Chloe. So I'm going to go ahead and call this episode quits. I don't want to cut anything because it was all story related. And this game is really all story. So without it, you know, obviously it's going to be some of the things that happened later might not make sense to the to you guys if I cut things now. So I'm going to go ahead and leave what's there. And even though we really didn't do much. Even if you crashed on me. Chloe, I'm, I'm doing an outro. Thank you. Okay, so even though not a lot happened, I'm going to go ahead and call it quits here. We've been recording for about 25 minutes, so you know, might as well be a great, uh, might as well be a good stopping point. So I'm going to go ahead and call it call it quits. Thank you guys for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it, even though nothing happened. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, and if you like the content, because there's definitely more coming in the future. We have a schedule set up. It is in the comment of my Mad Max video if you have, if you
haven't seen it, it's well, like should be the top top rated. Yeah, Max. It still feels the same. Chloe, what? I'm doing my outro. Thank you, thank you guys for watching. I will see you all in the next video. Take care, have a great day, and peace out.